Hello everyone. This is going to be the eighth video in the series of George Gurdjieff and the Anagram. And here we are going to discuss more about uh, Pythagoras as such. And uh, there will be probably some videos which should be continued together for Pythagoras because there is something really important that we need to introduce and talk about, uh, basically about Pythagorean harmonies. Uh, so let's start with that. Uh, let's have a quick recap about the things that we have discussed till now. Let's say, for example, we have discussed about the anagram as such, basically. So we came to know that, okay, in the anagram, there is first of all a circle, so which has been shown over here. We have something like a triangle, which is the second law called as law of three. And uh, this is among one of the fundamental laws about uh, the universe as such. And it is also called as the second tri amzi no? right? So uh, this being the second law, we have the first law, which is a law of seven uh, students of WD GAN specifically know about it as law of vibrations, which is also been called as law of octaves or the law of hepta para parsino, right? Now, connecting law of vibration to law of octaves, we'll be also talking about Pythagoras because Pythagoras was one of the person who has talked about uh, the octaves as such. And he was the person who was uh, fairly instrumental in introducing us to the world of music, world of octaves as such. Basically. So let's try to grab those uh, understanding also. The definition itself, which has been given, talks uh, about a lot of things. It talks about mostly having twice as many vibrations per second or below a given tone having half as many vibrations. So it's generally about being a twice or maybe half. So it's either doubling that is twice or half of that. So this is what uh, basic octaves uh, talks about. And also the interval of eight diatonic degrees between a tone and either of its octaves. So this is again one more very important thing that we need to understand in terms of uh, octaves. We'll go further and try to understand something which is again very important. Uh, so this is going to be especially in terms of uh, Pythagoras also because uh, this is something really important for us to understand. So here we get seen some of something called as uh, Pythagorean harmonies. So let's just try to read this. Upon them, we can effectuate a detailed examination into the diatonic structure of the octaves. Note, between the initial vibration and either double or half of that vibration, six additional diatonic vibrations come into existence. These six additional vibrations occur at specific ratios, which were first documented by Pythagoras, a philosopher, a mathematician, in the 6th century BC and are now fittingly called the Pythagorean harmonies, right? Now, uh, Pythagoras is also very important and uh, not only in this book, but also about a book of uh, W.D. Gant, which is uh, Tunnel Through the Air. We also come to about uh, Pythagorean, right? Uh, so let's try to go towards Tunnel Through the Air. And if we see specifically on page number 191, right? Now, again, page number 191 is very important. I'll tell you why and how it is there. But let's first of all try to focus on Pythagoras as such. Now, probably if you search across for Pythagoras, yes, on this page number, you'll be getting about Pythagoras. And what does it specifically talk about? Pythagoras said, there are in a woman's eye two sorts of tear. The one of grief, the other of decade. Right. I think that it is because there are two kinds of men, one who appreciate love and honor and gives sympathy, the other kind who is selfish, expects something for nothing and must meet with Dakit. Right. Now, uh, see, again, if you if you try to understand and analyze what Pythagoras said, he was probably talking about some ratios. There are in woman's eye two sorts of tears. So two is one and one of grief. So we have numbers two and one. So we had one more ratio, which is two is to one, which is again very critical. And we have seen this previously also. So we'll try to analyze that part also as especially. But uh, here we wanted to emphasize more of on Pythagoras. That is the first part. So he's again talking about octaves, music, music. Probably we'll try to discuss this more of into details. But yes, octaves is something which is really important as such. So this is the first part uh, talking about the number 191 as such. So it's not necessary. See, W.D. Gan was a very smart man. He has talked to us about various things together, very important things on very important page numbers. Now it's not necessary that you'll be getting the exact thing on the exact page number, right? Uh, 
if you if you follow astrology yes you know that okay there is always a difference of a day or two right so this is just a clue in terms of the number probably if you guessed it well enough so this is the first clue i am going to give you one more clue that is uh, very important we generally calculate days in terms of week and maybe hours in some specific hours during a day so probably this would be one of the hints and you should be getting why this number 191 is important so if you get probably the answer to that you can drop a message in the description and probably i'll try to gift you with something which is really important for me right so uh, let's get back to uh, our detailed discussion about uh, pythagoras as such basically so here we saw some really important conclusions as such because uh, Dabati Khan has specifically talked about talked to us about uh, Pythagoras, and we know that if he is talking something about Pythagoras, this is really important. And if he says this six additional vibrations occur at specific ratios, which were first documented by Pythagoras, so if they occur again and again in terms of ratios, uh, we see that Dabati Khan has specifically talked about this thing, which is maybe probably in terms of uh, cycles within the cycles wheel within a wheel so now wheel within the wheel is again really important for us we need to understand what exactly it is and how do things happen so probably for that let's try to go to again uh the book tunnel through there so probably so if we go across on page number 78 yes we'll be again finding something which is critical which is wheel within a wheel right so here again we come to know about wheel within the wheel within a wheel and probably this thing has been repeated every now and then again because this was one of the important things cycles within cycles wheel within the wheel uh, probably something important and we again come to know over here the, the six additional vibrations occur at specific ratios which were first documented by pythagoras so this is if they keep on occurring every now and then in terms of ratios probably this is something really important for us to understand let's try to look at those parts uh, one by one probably we'll try to take some examples for this part so that we are able to have a better clarity of this and uh, to take this example let's probably try to go on uh, the charts so previously on the chart uh, during few of the videos in one of the examples that we have taken we came to know that okay yes there are certain ratios which are there between the bull and the bear cycle right now if you try to check over here in terms of uh, ratios yes we see that okay if this is my first ratio and a reversal which is there probably this reversal come down to somewhere around 50% uh, uh, in terms of uh, the ratios part so from this low to a high i get a reversal which is probably coming around to a 50% part right so again if we go in one of the ratios which is there starting from uh, probably to the low yes this is the low uh, let's say probably the end of the bull beer cycle and we start the bull cycle from here further and if we see the reversal which is again a beer cycle because this is uh, a monthly chart yes uh, so probably if we see a reversal in terms of a uh, beer cycle yes this point probably just come down to somewhere around the 50 percent level so bang opposite on 50 percent level uh, so yes this is very critical and uh, if as uh, been written in the book that yes probably these are ratios which have been formed so if these are ratios probably this should be happening every now and then let's try to identify something which probably happened at a nearby time right the low was in the month of uh, june 22 from a low of june 22 we got a high somewhere around in august then in september so probably the candle did open over here it went to a high and from there probably it started moving down right now if we check down how much it has moved down somewhere around it has come down to almost 50 percent level right so now this is uh, really interesting for us to understand the market has been moving down to a 50 percent level and if we look on this time frame probably this is the monthly time frame let's go to a smaller time frame let's say for example in daily and try to understand this so this low was in june and this high was somewhere around in september so yes we had a low over here in the month of june and this high was there in the month of uh, september right now if i look over here yes we got a bottom and we got a high right so from this bottom to the high i got a reversal yes re this reversal has been coming somewhere around by 30th of uh, september and this is almost nearer to the 50 percent level right uh, now something really interesting about this part which we need to understand and uh, try to find out what exactly this thing is right now if i check down yes probably this was a bigger ratio in terms of uh, the time frame because if i look down probably from this time frame uh, maybe somewhere around from this low to this this was
exactly coming at 91 days uh, 91 days we again know very important uh, because this is something related to the gan emblem that we have seen that there are cycles which are there for 90 days 120 days so this is one of the things uh, which we would be able to probably get a hint of right and uh, yes probably because the cycles are there again the price which is there that has been coming down to the exact 50% level now if you try to check down probably in one more uh, ways probably this we try to check or maybe make understand people in terms of uh, our course which is there so if you are interested in course definitely you can uh, get in touch with us now let's say for example i start from here to probably this point right and try to see at the theory part which wd gan or maybe uh, uh, what has been written about specifically pythagoras this says this six additional vibrations occur at specific ratios which were first documented by pythagoras a philosopher and mathematician right now it talks about specifically six additional vibrations which are there inside that right if i try to check on the chart from uh, this level which was there probably till this level and if we try to understand how many ratios have been happening so probably this is one this is two or this is three this is four this is five this is six so from this low to this low probably we had the first ratio the second one the third one the fourth one the fifth one and sixth one and uh, probably if i try to understand more of in detail probably this we try to check or maybe make understand people in terms of uh, our course which is there so if you are interested in course definitely you can uh, get in touch with us now let's say for this was a low or this was a high this was again somewhere around a low this was a midway point again somewhere around a high point nearer to this this again somewhere around a low point and a low point right so probably if we try to check in terms of ratios so probably something really important and interesting that we can come to know yes and uh, if i want to probably try to understand more about at this part why this part is important and why this level is important for me so if i check at this low and maybe probably this high and try to understand and maybe interpret more of into a detail part what i get is a low a high and a reversal which has again come down to the 50% part right uh, so probably what has been given to us in terms of octave that is uh, doubling and half uh, does make sense uh, we have seen this on probably a bigger time frame over here we have seen this on uh, maybe probably the bigger time frame which is in terms of monthly cycles right so on the monthly cycles this cycles do happen right if we check down in terms of daily cycles which do probably happen for months together that is 3 months all together yes this does work if we look on the smaller time frame yes from this low to this low again it has come down to a 50% level and probably this was there on probably this was there again for 14 days so even if i look at the smaller cycles which is in terms of 14 days yes it does work if i look at the bigger cycle which is there for almost 3 months it does work if i look at uh, probably the bigger cycles which are there in terms of uh, months yes it does again work so this probably this we try to check or maybe make understand people in terms of uh, our course which is there so if you are interested in course definitely you can uh, get in touch with us now let's say for that's why wd gan has been talking about uh, wheels within the wheels wheels within the wheels cycles within cycles because this are prima facie very important and probably we try to get the ratios also here this six additional vibrations occur at specific ratios which were first documented by pythagoras right uh, knowing in terms of time and price both are very critical because we need to understand that how this happens exactly right so gan emblem does play a crucial and important role for us to understand things right because uh, we definitely get this ratios which are prima facie very important right now it is not that okay this specifically happens only at a specific part which we are trying to show you across various levels let's say for example we started from somewhere around on uh, this high which was during the beer cycle of uh, 2020 which was a big crash as such so talking from the high to the low yes the first reversal that we get across is around at a 50% level right now this is something really important and uh, for us to understand yes this matches with various ratios right 
this is really fabulous and this is something really interesting that we need to understand right so understand from the high to the low yes i got my first resistance which was there at 50 percent level right uh, if i try to probably check this in a different way so let's say for example this is my high this is my low right so this low was probably around right yep yeah. so probably this should be better so this is my low this is my high and uh, probably if i look out for the reversal which is there yes probably this reversal level which is there again this has been matching right so probably the resistance which is there exactly that has been coming to that part and you probably try to look down further yes this support which has been coming up this is again exactly coming to this part right so this is again very critical uh important for us to understand as especially because this has been creating some important ratios to us right so they had the time from a different perspective in terms of different cycles so i had this high and from this i had this high right so this days were somewhere around uh, in terms of 100 days probably i look at a ratio of 50 percent half or doubling probably the half goes to 50 right uh, so if it is 101 days it should be coming somewhere around to 50 days which is there so let's say if i look at this ratio i try from this low probably till this one so this is coming around to 55 days right so this is 100 days this is 55 days right so probably i can see something in terms of uh, the ratios which probably are been matching over here and it does give us a good sound or maybe a sense that yes this practically things have been happening not only that if i look on the smaller time frame how is the look smaller time frame if i try to match across in terms of uh, days yes probably this would be again matching how that is let me show it across so if i have this low and probably if i have this high right if i have this low if i have this high probably starting from this point to the high this is somewhere around 37 days right so again the same fundamental ratio of half right if i apply that and if i try to check from this high point to probably this low point this is coming down to 18 days so if it is somewhere around let's say 38 and half of that is 19 yes this is coming around to 18 days right super magic which wdcan has worked across on and these are various ratios i mean like of course if you want to get or maybe understand more about uh, the details of uh, squaring of time and price of course you can contact us we do teach it across in terms of uh, few courses which start with uh, the law of vibration and probably try to go to the next level so if you want to understand that yes definitely you can get in touch with us on uh, the details which have been given and provided over here so definitely we'll be telling about more details as such so uh yes this is something really critical and important for us to understand in terms of uh, the ratios part as we move gradually further to what we have to discuss as such in terms of uh, Pythagorean harmonies as especially in terms of uh, the doubling and half part or maybe in terms of the vibrations which have been happening right uh, the six additional vibrations occur at specific ratios because the ratios are again very critical important for us to understand so definitely we'll go through, across through these things one by one try to understand more of in details uh, so one of the important thing that we want to tell over here is till now if you have not subscribed to our youtube channel so our humble request is please do subscribe to the youtube channel uh, please do like the videos which are there that boosts our motivation altogether to create some kind of similar kind of videos which are there which uh, probably would be getting more details as such and please do comment on the video so that we understand about your feedback what exactly do you want from us so that we can make similar kind of videos as such okay thank you so much bye and let's meet you across in the next video thank you bye take care